So earlier today, I've just discovered that H2O.ai has just released a new framework called the H2O Wave, which allows us to convert our machine learning pipeline into a AI-based application. And so it's quite similar to other packages such as the Streamlit or Dash from Plotly. And so what H2O Wave allows us to do is allows data scientists, machine learning engineer, and also a software developer to quickly implement a AI application and also with visualization as well. And so you could create dashboard AI application for prediction, for model prediction, and many more. And so let's have a look. So you can see here that this is an example of the H2O Wave real-time AI application. And so the data is for the cryptocurrency, the various coins. And you can see that in every second, the price and also the plot will be updated. And so you can modify this to other data such as the stock price or gasoline price or other prices that are updated in real time. And you can see here that the H2O Wave can readily accommodate the usage of its own machine learning software, such as the H2O machine learning platform, Sparkling Water for integration with the Spark, and also the H2O Auto ML. And you're going to be seeing in just a moment here that it also support other libraries as well, such as Scikit-Learn, TensorFlow, PyTorch, and other popular libraries, such as NumPy, SciPy, Pandas, and etc. And here you can see that it readily supports all of the major cloud platforms such as Amazon Web Service, Google Cloud, Azure from Microsoft, and it can be installed on Linux operating system, on a Mac OS, and also on a Windows OS as well. And you can see here that there are more than 100 recipes for the AI application that you could get your inspiration from. And so it's going to be from the GitHub of the H2O.ai. So I'm going to show you that in just a moment. And so you can see here that the development will be done in Python. And so the underlying code is just a couple of lines, and then you will get this nice looking application. And so if you're changing the input argument, the application will also change the plotting feature for you as well. So getting started is as easy as downloading the software and then watching a tour of how it is implemented and then completing a few tutorial. And some of the example application that you could get inspired from are as follows here. And this include mitigating churn risk, online shopping recommendations, social media sentiment. And so let's have a look. Let's start with a simple one, guessing the number. And so that will take us to the GitHub of the H2O.ai. And so the Application here is essentially a game where you're guessing the number. So you're selecting a number from the slider and it will tell whether you're guessing it correctly, whether your guessing should go up or should it go down and then whether to quit the game. Okay, let's have a look at more. How about social media sentiment? And so you put in your Twitter data, your Twitter password and token as well. And then you can see here that this is a dashboard using your Twitter data, and then it's going to be performing some sentiment analysis on it. And actually, you could just navigate yourself to the web app here. And then there are other examples here, sales forecasting. Okay, you could have this visualization. And then this is how you will run the code, sales forecasting, explaining ratings. Let's have a look at that. Okay, so it will generate this word cloud. All right, and how to implement this. Okay, and so you can see here that you could do a lot of interesting projects using the H2O Wave, and it is a new AI application development framework. And if you're finding value in this video, please give it a like, subscribe if you haven't yet done so, hit on the notification bell in order to be notified of the next video. And as always, the best way to learn data science is to do data science. And please enjoy the journey. Thank you for watching. Please like, subscribe, and share, and I'll see you in the next one. But in the meantime, please check out these videos.